Hi guys, so today I'm going to be telling you a story of an encounter that made me grow up. So um, I'm going to go back to February of 2021. Uh, me and my fiance had just bought a house. Um, it was during the rise of the market. So a lot of things were going on um, in our personal lives, our financial lives, our work lives. And it just so happened that we had gotten COVID uh, previously a few months ago. So this has to play within his health. He ended up getting into um, heart failure. We didn't know the actual severity of it when it was going on, but we did get transferred to a Nashville facility. Um, so we were just going there one day thinking that he was going to just be seeing a specialist to see if he had gotten better, gotten worse. And when we were there, he was told that he had less than a year to live if he didn't get the LVAD device implanted in his heart. And so what the LVAD device does is it essentially stops the heart. Well, it doesn't start, stop the heart, but it helps the heart pump and function regularly without exhausting the heart um and so that was a lot to process especially with how young we were how many things were moving in our lives we had just bought a house three days before um, we had a lot of things going on and we just didn't know how bad he had really gotten and so when we finally made the decision to get the LVAD it was about a, a week after we got admitted and during the LVAD surgery, he ended up having a stroke, which affected his speech, his mobility. Um, he wouldn't be able to look at a can of Coke and be able to say that, hey, that's a can. Um, he knew what it was, but he couldn't say what it was. So it affected a lot of things with him mentally which was devastating to the both of us. Uh, we didn't know really how to cope with that. Um, but after therapies and, you know, working with the doctors, we, you know, finally got him to where he was able to function again. And if you didn't know him, he was a regular person, just might have a slight stutter. But during that whole process, it really took a lot of patience and just a lot of uh, courage, passion for me, his family, for him, with him not even being able to know what was going on with him, why he couldn't talk. I couldn't imagine being myself in that position. Um, so overall, it really did help us grow as just individuals, as a couple. Um, it, the therapies were really extensive. Being in Nashville, we were in Nashville for probably almost a month, um, and then they finally let us go home after that. Um, and even after going home, we still had, I think it was probably two to three times a week for therapies, because once we finally did get home, he had gotten better and improved, but there were still a lot of things that needed adjustments and just more experience and practice and letting his brain rewire how he talks. As for his heart health, everything was fine after that. So we're very happy that we haven't had any issues. It was just the experience of all of it at once was just a lot to take in as young as we were. But overall, it really has helped every single one of us his family his family were so supportive and so kind while we were there I don't know what we would have done without them but for me personally it was really nice knowing that we had other people supporting us and I think that's what I really took from this whole experience that made me really grow up was that we have other people to help us if we need it you know we don't have to be by ourselves we don't have to just count on each other we have other 
areas in our life and other people that want to support us in any way they can. And we didn't even ask, you know, they, they jumped on it. And I think that's a lot of things that uh, people my age specifically are afraid of is asking for help when they need it. And for me and my fiance, we really did understand that we weren't going to be able to do this just by ourselves, that we needed the additional support. So I'm very grateful. He's very grateful that we were able to get what we needed when we needed. And now we're better than ever. And I don't think that we would have ever grown and developed as much as we had without this experience. I would never wish it on anyone, at least what we had went through, but I'm very happy where we are now. He's very happy where we are now. And overall, it really has made us a stronger couple and a stronger family. And I'm just so excited to see what we're going to do in the future. Um, we're still working on our house. We're still working on his health, which is again, significantly improved. Um, but yeah, my overall takeaway of this is it really helped me understand what being an adult was and being grown up was and how sticky of a situation it can be. And it, it's just very good to have overwhelming support from family. And we're just really grateful for that. Thank you.